This video details how Publishers in Brightspace can enable and use Course Publisher to publish a course package as an LTI 1.3 link. It also explains how recipients in a different instance of Brightspace can enable and use LTI 1.3 links to launch the published course package. By the end of this video, publishers and recipients should be able to identify and understand the supported formats for Course Publisher tools and identify and understand the difference between a publisher or host instance of Brightspace and a recipient instance of Brightspace. By the end of this video, publishers should be able to enable the course publisher tool and the publisher instance of Brightspace using the config variable browser, roles and permissions, and organizational tools. They should also be able to create a recipient using the course publisher tool and add a course to their recipient. By the end of this video, recipients should be able to register and deploy an LTI tool to host the published course package, make the tool available to the publisher instance, create a new LTI link for the deployed LTI tool, add the LTI link as an external tool activity in the content of a course in the recipient instance, and open and view the published course package. It is important to note that Course Publisher supports Aviation Industry, CBT, Computer Based Training Committee, AICC 4.0, and Learning Tools Interoperability LTI 1.3 Advantage Standards. Course Publisher Package will not integrate with an LMS that does not support one of these standards. This video only details how to configure and deploy course packages using LTI 1.3 links from Brightspace to Brightspace. The Publisher Instance of Brightspace is the source of your course package. It is where you, the system administrator, can use Course Publisher tool to create a recipient and deploy a course package to the recipient instance using an LTI deployment. The recipient instance of Brightspace is the destination or host instance that receives the course package. It is where a system administrator who manages that instance will register an LTI tool to host the deployed course package add it to the relevant course content as an LTI link. From the Publisher instance of Brightspace, ensure you have turned on Course Publisher. Navigate to Admin Tools, Organization Tools, and turn on Publisher. Then, navigate to Admin Tools, Roles and Permissions, and ensure that your role has the Publish, Publish Course permission set at the organization level. Next, you must ensure that when you deploy a course package to a recipient instance and a user launches that course package, they are automatically enrolled in that course as the correct role. For example, in general, system administrators prefer recipients to be automatically enrolled in the deployed course as learners. You must set that using a configuration variable. Navigate to Admin Tools Config Variable Browser and search for d2l.system.enrollment.learnerrole.org/unit. Under Override Values, click Add Value. Define the desired org unit ID and select a role value. Click Save to add the override value for your org unit. Before we show you how to create a new recipient, it is important to note that the recipient name you choose is customizable and should reflect your institutional needs. However, the name should be as unique as possible to identify the recipient's instance and differentiate it from other recipients you may create. As a best practice, we recommend that you use the first eight letters of the recipient instance URL. In the following example, we include the first eight letters of the recipient URL, recipient docsert 2 Now create a new recipient. Navigate to Admin Tools, Course Publisher. Click Create Recipient. Enter a recipient name and click Create. From the recipient page, click Add Course. Choose any course or courses you want to add to the recipient. Click Select and then click Confirm. You must copy and provide settings information to the recipient system administrator 
to register an LTI tool to receive the course package in their instance. To access that information, click Recipient Settings or the COG icon to open the Recipient Settings dialog. Under 1 LTI Tool Registration, click Copy All to copy the domain, redirect URLs, OpenID Connect Login URL, and Keyset URL. Finally, from the Recipient page, click the Link to Course icon next to your course. From the Link to Course dialog, click Copy LTI 1.3 to Clipboard to copy the link to your course. This is required by the Recipient System Administrator. Set an enrollment limit for your course package. Click Package Config. Select Enforce Enrollment Limit. Enter an enrollment limit and click Done. To synchronize the Publisher Instance Gradebook with the recipient, click Package Config. Select Enable Intermediate Grade Passback for LTI links and then click Done. The system administrator for the recipient instance of Brightspace must have appropriate external learning tools role permissions to access LTI Advantage and register a new LTI tool used to host the LTI link deployed from the publisher's instance. The recipient instance of Brightspace must have an active course ready to add an external tool activity or LTI link to. It is important to note that the LTI tool name you choose is customizable and should reflect your institutional needs. However, the name should be as unique as possible to clearly identify the publisher instance that the tool will host. As a best practice, we recommend that you use the first eight letters of the publisher instance URL. In this example, we are using publisher docsert1. In the recipient instance, navigate to Admin Tools, Manage Extensibility, and click the LTI Advantage tab. Click Register Tool. From the Register a Tool page, select Standard. Enter a name. Using the recipient settings information provided to you from the Publisher Instance System Administrator, enter the domain, redirect URL, Open ID Connect Login and Keyset URL. Leave the target link URL blank. Under Extensions, select Assignment and Grade Services, Names and Role Provisioning Services, and Platform Notification Services. Note that deep linking is not supported in this context. Under Roles, select Send Institution Role. Click Register. You must provide the Publisher System Administrator with required information. From the Brightspace Registration Details dialog, copy the following. Client ID, Brightspace Keyset URL, Brightspace OAuth2 Access Token URL, OpenID Connect Authentication Endpoint, Brightspace OAuth2 Audience, and Issuer. Click View Deployments to move to the next step. Click New Deployment. Under Tool, select the applicable tool. Enter a name. Note that you can also customize extensions, security settings, and configuration settings to meet your institutional requirements. Under Make Tools Available To, click Add or Units. Search for a course. Select a course. And click Add. Then click Create Deployment. From the Brightspace Deployment Details dialog, copy the deployment ID to provide to the Publisher Instance System Administrator. Click Done. Now let's briefly look at the Publisher Instance perspective again. The Publisher System Administrator must now add in recipient platform registration information provided by the recipient system administrator. As a publisher, from the recipient settings dialog, scroll down to enter the following information. Client ID, deployment ID, public key URL, token URL, 
URL, Authentication URL, Audience URL, and Issuer. Click Done. Now let's shift back to the recipient system administrator perspective. The next step is to create a link that will allow you to add the external tool activity link to the content of a course in the recipient instance. From the Brightspace Deployment Details dialog, click View Links to be brought to the Links page of LTI Advantage Deployments. Click New Link. Enter a name. We recommend that you name the link the same name as the publisher course that you want to link to. In this example, we call it Astronomy 101B. Enter the URL. This is the link to course provided from the course publisher by the publisher system administrator. Finally, click Save and Close. Navigate to Content. Click to expand a unit and click Add Existing. Click External Tool Activity. Select your LTI link. To launch the published course, click Open Link. You have now successfully enabled and launched a Brightspace Course Package LTI link using Course Publisher. Thank you for watching.